whenever we color grade on DaVinci Resolve and we see it on our PC's screen, it looks so good. But when we upload it and we see it through our phone screen, we say like, this is not how it looked like on my DaVinci Resolve when I was color grading on my PC. It was different, it was having a lot of contrast, it was sharp, now it's looking very low contrast and different and the colors are desaturated and all that. So to resolve this issue, Blackmagic have made an app which can show you the video when you are color grading on DaVinci Resolve so you really know how will it look when you will see it on your phone after. And in this video, I'm gonna show you everything you need to know to use that application. First of all, make sure that your DaVinci on your PC and then your DaVinci monitor on your phone are having the same Blackmagic account on them. And then after that, make sure that both of your devices, your PC and your phone are connected to a very good internet connection. When you have two of these things done, you are set up to go. After that, let me just show you how you can set it up in your DaVinci Resolve and then on your phone as well. So first of all, on DaVinci Resolve, basically you come here, I am editing this uh, project for now. So on this, if I wanna see how it will look on my phone, I will just come on workspace here. And in workspace, I will go on here, remote monitoring. When I will click on it, I will just have to choose the codec first. And for me, I always keep it H.264 8 bit, which I think is enough for this kind of video to be uh, streamed. And then after that bit rate, I keep 12 MB per second, which should be uh, okay because I have been using it for a long time and I'm okay with this. And then I start session. When I will click on start session, it will take like four to five seconds and it will generate a key like this. I will just simply copy this key and this is the same key which I will need on my phone when I will log in. So let me just go to my phone now and show you how you can do it on your phone. So I will open my DaVinci monitor app and then in that it will ask me to sign in with my Blackmagic Cloud which I put my details and you have to make an account and uh, log in. It will ask me here for that session code. I will just paste the session code and join. When I will join, it will say, please wait. And after five to 10 seconds, it will open up. There you go. Now, if I will play my video, I can see my video and I can hear how it's gonna sound like. So else I'm doing in DaVinci Resolve free version. So let me, this is how simple it is to set up DaVinci Monitor app. And it's a very, very helpful tool. To be honest, I use it on every single video of mine because I really know that it's always gonna look different than my Mac screen. So it's better to see it before uh, rather than seeing it on YouTube and saying, oh my God, I could have adjusted this video. I hope this video was helpful for you. If it was, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more amazing videos like this. Thank you so much for watching.